right, gang. Uh, all you gearheads, we're going to go over some gear today. How's that sound? Okay. We'll, uh, we'll start with the cymbals. Um, since I don't have the monster chops that some of the more serious Dennis Chambers, Neil Perk kind of guys have, I do a lot of my stuff filled wise with accents with cymbals. You can blame Richie Hayward for that. I studied him for a while when we toured with Little Feet for about six weeks in 1992. And I stole all kinds of stuff from him. And so he's responsible for these little splash symbols. These are 10 inch Zildjian. All my Zildjians are Zildjian. They're the only serious choice. 10 inch. This is an A custom. This is a Z custom. Z3, I believe, but it, they're pounded. This one's pounded out. Use them for the splash effect. Then up here above them, when we get really crazy, we go. This is a 20 inch China trash. Over here, we have here and here. These are 18 inch A custom projection crashes. The projection crashes, they ring for a while after you hit them. And I have to have those because I play with these really loud guitar players and I have to have something that cuts through. So the projections, they do that pretty good. They do a pretty good job. Here in the middle, this is a, a this is a nine and a half or ten inch Zybel. That's Z-I dash B-E-L. And that's I only use that a couple times a night. Well, bad to the bone, and then and, and, uh, I just throw it, but it's just an accent. Oh, and in a gear jammer, we do a little uh, do a little bit of that. Down here on the ride is a 22 inch A custom ping ride. My son and bell. This is a 14 inch A custom crash symbol. A little stronger than the than than the uh, than the 10 inch splashes makes a little stronger statement when you need it. And this, my favorite symbol, is a 22 inch China trash. The hi hats are a unique combination. They're 15 inch, and the top is a quick beat. The bottom is the bottom from a new beat set. And there are two different sets, quick beat, which I don't believe they make anymore, at least in the 15s. And then uh, new beats, they do, they do to make them. But the reason that I have different ones is because I sat with a uh, brilliant mine at Zildjian, his name is John King, and he sat with me, and he knows much more about symbols than I will ever know, and uh, he said, well, how do you play? And he, what he meant was, do you play stick on the, like this, or do you play with more definition, like that? So at the time, we were doing a lot of Chuck Berry stuff in the, in the show, and I was playing most doing a lot of that so he somehow comes out with this configuration and this was it and and I had never been able to find anything that even comes close to matching it so I'm in great debt to my buddy John King since retired now but nice man and uh, well, that you know that covers the the symbols um, 
symbols are a very personal thing and you're going to need, if you're just starting out, you're going to need to try different things and, 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 and uh, see what fits you personally because it's a very, they're very personal, it's a very personal thing. So, it's all good. I've always had, I've tried different kinds. Zildjian has always been the one for me. So, that's, that's all I have to say about symbols for today, I think.